everyone, this is Leslie with the Plaid Poodle. And um, this video, I'm gonna demonstrate these little party favors that I made uh, for my um, uh, stamp and style class members, just a little thank you. And they're perfect size to hold the little um, Ghirardelli Squares chocolates. So um, to make these, we use the Top Note uh, Bigs die. And I'm using a piece of crisp cantaloupe cardstock. Sandwich that in there. Run it through. And then I'm also using for the uh, top layer a piece of the watercolor wonder designer series paper from the occasions catalog that is still available through um, June 2nd and these big styes are great if if you are making party favors for for a lot of uh, people or several at a time because you can cut uh, more than one sheet at a time which I did for my class Okay, now if you, I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but there's just a slight um, perforation uh, around the um, die, and I'm going to just cut along that perforation on this top layer so that we can have a little, uh, it's framed by the crisp cantaloupe. And if you just cut along that preparation, just have your scissors follow it. You can kind of, I, I don't know if you can hear the little punch like you're punching out. These designer series papers are really cute. And they coordinated perfectly with the, um, the end colors this year. Okay. Sorry about that, I didn't have my snail available. I'm just gonna attach the paper to the crisp cantaloupe. And then I'm going to just run a couple of score lines with my stamp and trimmer. What I did was I just put the um, the pointed edge is right along the cutting line um, and moved it over about an eighth of an inch. Score it and then the same thing on the other side. I'm just going to move it over about an eighth of an inch. And I don't know if this step was necessary. You could probably just fold it in half. But since the little chocolate squares are a little thicker, then to attach the chocolate, I used a piece of double sided tape on the back of the package and just adhered it so that it doesn't fall out. And then I took a piece of Whisper White Taffeta Ribbon. Determine how much you need to just do a little knot. And I went ahead and put a little snail um, kind of in the center just so it doesn't fall off when the recipient opens her chocolate package. 
<laughs> this is the most difficult part of the is determining how much you need for the um, the knot. Then I just tied a little knot here. Try and do a flat knot. This is where I get into trouble with my big fingers. Then for the embellishment, which you could you could just leave it as is, but I took a little scrap of the crisp cantaloupe and with the one inch paper punch, I punched a circle. And then in whisper white, I stamped a little um, butterfly with crisp cantaloupe uh, ink. Um, and actually this this stamp is from a retired stamp set collage curios and I took the three-quarter inch circle and then I popped it up with a little stamp and dimensional back and then a little snail adhesive and attach it right on the ribbon so simple little um, party favor Anyway, um, go to my blog, www.thepladpoodle.com, for the dimensions and um, for more ideas and um, inspiration. Thanks for joining me.